Right guys, back again. Right, so I'm doing now a bit of reverse engineering. That pipe, this one, does fit. S smaller one, too small. Now the big one is a little bit too big, but I think I can make it work. So that's the old bottom one where you get all your worms and everything in. So this will go now in, in here, like that. Pushing down. This bit here goes in there all the way because that's where your water will come down and it obviously comes up from the bottom. Now I need to cut that to exactly the right size, put him in with the bell mouth which does fit over this. So you can see I've just taken off the old one, this one. So maybe it's going to work guys, I've just got to get this cut to the right length. Right. I'll catch you again later, bye. Right, so, my reverse engineering. So I've cut a piece of this pipe here. Uh, I've had to make the hole in this cover, this just here, a little bit bigger. Because this pipe's a little bit too big, but now it fits. The other problem I've got, obviously the other end of this orange pipe, that's the bell mouth, which you need to fit over what's already in there. And the problem is these filters won't fit over it. So if you're looking, I don't know if you can just see in there, they don't go all the way down to the top, if you understand, because that's going to be turned all the way up anyway. So I've saved a filter. So hopefully that's going to work. So I've got this ready. I'm going to try and get it all back together, then I'll uh, come back to you guys. Catch you later. Right, so that's the result. All back together, all secure. I'll see if I can, I don't know if you can see in there. Uh, let me have a look. I don't know if you'll see it, but when I turn the handle, everything's turning inside. Perfect. So it's spinning them sponges. So actually that's ready. I've just got to disconnect power for other, other cover uh, and put that back on and he's actually ready. Right guys, I'll come back again later. Cheers, bye bye. Well, back again peeps, right, apart from a lot of crap to tidy up, all this, clean up, all this, we're done. So there we go. So I've set the new one slightly lower, well I haven't set it slightly lower, the ground's a little bit lower there. So maybe I will lift that up, but the link together, everything's working, water's beautiful and clear. So I will change that pipe in between them when that clear one comes and then I just need to cap off outlets. So that's it. So the principle does work. Uh, better than throwing it away. What I've got to do next now is uh, make a cover because uh, they, they get too hot in the sun. This, let me, in fact, let me just get it shade a minute. Yeah, they, they actually get quite hot in the sun. Let me just zoom in and then it becomes a bit more flexible so I've got some wood I'll uh, waterproof it and put that over it I mean there's going to be all plant pots in front of it you know hide them away and then all that area is going to be covered in crushed rock and plant pots just so it's easy maintenance so that'll be the next job I found someone who can deliver a minimum of four cubic meters I only need like one point probably two cubic meters now and that rest going to go in pond uh, bottom, but I can see that water's clearing up already because I can see pump on bottom there that fountain Yeah, so Everything works like I said aesthetically not that good But once there's some plant pots in front of him and a cover over the top and there'll be a plant pot on top of that as well I'm sure it'll be looking good So what a grueler of a Saturday with a lot of tidying up to do now get rid of all this I can now tidy it cobble out and that's me done. Time is it now? Quarter to three. I think it's time to sit down with a cold beer and chill out and enjoy it. So there we go. Right, guys, uh, have a good weekend and uh, thanks for watching. Bye.